Hello, and welcome back to more Let's Play, the original Legend of Zelda on the NES. My name is Keith, aka Keithius, and when we last left off, we were in level 4, which I failed to complete because I took too long to get there. But... Ooh, ah. Switch back to the boomerang. My bad. Ah. Anyways, let's continue on, shall we? Oh, god, more of these guys. Why won't you just die? Ah! Annoying as crap, I hate them. I didn't even get anything from my troubles. Well, now we're back in this room. And of course, I can apparently throw fire on water. It won't go out. It's magic, who cares? Ah, yes. This dungeon. Yes, here we go. Money, 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 money. Take a shortcut. Technically, you can bomb through, I believe, all four walls in here. I'm just gonna go this way. Ooh, who's this? Somebody who I should probably use a bomb on? No, I think I'm strong enough now. I can just kill him outright. Ah, come here, you bastard. I don't remember you being so tough. Man. I'm losing my touch. Shut up. Old man, walk into the waterfall. You don't even get anything for that. I think it's just like a fortune teller or something. But you know, honestly, I've I've forgotten what it is specifically he's um, referencing. Oh well, we'll find out. God. Uh oh. Uh, I took a hit. As I said, I'm old, my reflexes aren't as good as they used to be, and I could swear sometimes that this USB gamepad I'm using has a bit of lag. Respond as fast as, say, like an original Nintendo controller would. And now we've got a room full of bats to clean up. Annoying. Yeah, that's right, you stop moving, you stupid bat. Yeah, the game starts getting a little bit harder now. For instance, I'm going to die, so I'm going to use a potion. Which makes the most annoying sound in the world as you use it. And as you can see, it turned into a blue potion. Yay! There's no real strategy for this. You can try and dodge the little bullets as they come out, or you can just kill it. Another piece of Triforce. Yay! Isn't that exciting? Hmm. Sorry if I'm not terribly chipper today, but... Well, you know. Alright. So now we can go get another heart container as well. If we feel like it. Which we do. So I want me some heart containers. The sooner I can get my magic sword, the happier I'll be. Unfortunately, it's all the way over here. Of course, now I have to remember where the heck level 5 is. Hmm. I know where level 6 is. Oh, wait. I know. I know where we're going. It just took me a second. Uh, you know what they say, the mine's the first thing to go, and... Well... 
And up we go. I was just watching someone the other day playing, doing a let's play of the second quest, which I remember. I don't like to remember it, but I remember it as being ridiculously hard. I mean, it's just no holds barred. You know, balls to the wall, hard. Very easy to get stuck, get lost. Freaking invisible walls that you have to walk through. You can get trapped in certain places. Yeah. And here we go. The last heart container that you can get on the overworld. Oh, thanks for that fairy. Haha, <laughs> killed you. Stupid annoying fish man. Alright, now I have enough hearts to go get the magic sword, I think. Four, five, six, seven, eight, eight ten. Yep, twelve. Lest I lose, think I'm losing my mind. Which is entirely possible. And since we're up here, I might go walk into the waterfall like that old man said to do. And I think that's just a hint about where you're supposed to go next. Which means there's absolutely no reason for me to do it, because I already know where I'm going, but... Well, I'm not going to make it to the magic sword, because that's all the way over in the graveyard. And to do that, I need to go through the Lost Woods. But... I will be able to make it to the waterfall here, and that's probably where this video will end, at the rate I'm going. Link isn't exactly slow mover here, but... Hyrule's a big place. There's a lot of stuff. A lot of screens to cover. So here's our waterfall. Let's go walk into it. Yay. Pay me and I'll talk. Well, naturally, you have to pay her. Go up, up, up the mountain ahead. Yeah, that's exactly what I thought she was going to say. But I'm not going to do that. She's referencing the fact that you have to go over one screen and then go up three times. Because it looks like it just keeps repeating, but it's not. Actually, I can take a shortcut to the graveyard, can I? Now that I can go over water. Nice. We'll see how far we can get. Oh god, these guys. Chucking swords at you. No thanks. No thanks. You know what? Hang on a second. Alright, sorry for that. Had to uh, pause for a second there. We might just make it to the magic sword. Actually, we will make it to the... Let's see. There's a couple of you guys over here. And then there's you guys over here. I think it's this one. No. This one? Yep. Power bracelet. Yes. Now I can push rocks. Like those ones over there. And we get our first transportation system. Oh, I suppose I should show you what's here. Not that it really matters. Well, actually it kind of does. Watch this. Make myself a red potion. Combine two blue potions. Get a red potion. Yay! And I'm running out of time again, so I'm going to pause here. Ah, jeez, I got cut off there. Sorry about that. Uh, as I was saying, running out of time. I'm going to stop here. This has been Keith for Let's Play The Legend of Zelda on the NES. I will catch you next time. <laughs> Sorry about that uh, mix-up there. Uh, anyways, next time, more Legend of Zelda. It'll all be good. And we'll do level 5. No, first we'll get the magic sword. Then we'll do level 5. Alright, I'm rambling. That's all for now. Bye.